Finally, mortal. Remind me when I get my powers back to use them to expand the size of those horrible things. Yes, it was that bad. Small, cramped, and to make things worse, I heard all those little ones in the cages. I just wanted to rush back there and comfort them all. Yes, I could hear them. I could hear the cries of all my creations. So, shall we make our way to the home of the Oracle now? What do you mean, no? Do you not realize we're on a time limit? The warning on my weapons is still in place, but we cannot wait. No, we can't. What's so urgent that it would take priority over my search? Sleep? You're tired already? We just got here. I thought you humans loved exploring new places and seeing new things. Oh, I see. You're tired from the flight. Well... How long do you think you'll need to recover? A day? That's crazy. I can't wait that long. No, I can't. No, I cannot. I want to get this done quickly. Give me one reason why I shouldn't just leave you alone here and go look myself. <sighs> okay... That is fair. You are the only one with this money. Okay, how about this? I give you to the end of the day. I want a chance to get something to eat as well. The food on that plane was horrible. I can't understand why you humans talk about it so much. Okay, lead the way to the hotel room, mortal. Okay, we've made it in. I must say... This is much bigger than the room in your home. You should upgrade to this size when you get the chance. Oh, I see that's not how it works. Well, if we want to change things in our realm, all we have to do is snap our fingers. It's actually very easy. I heard a rumor that the god of lightning converted his realm to a sea of stars to impress a mortal he fell in love with. No, really. It's true. Well, mortal, ask your question. My realm? Why do you ask? Shouldn't you be getting some sleep? I'll answer your one question. Then you need to go to sleep. You did a lot of complaining when we landed. Okay. My realm. Well, it's a place where creativity blooms. A place where gods and mortals alike spend their time giving their particular creations a sense of wonder. How they perceive my realm is entirely up to them. Can you go there sometime? Maybe. We'll see. Now, go to sleep. Stay close to me, mortal. I don't need you getting lost. Good. Now, when she answers, let me do the talking. Let's just say she's... interesting. Evana, my old friend, it's been... Well, well, if it isn't the so-called Lord of Magic. Oh, man, that mark on your head must hurt. Here, let me give you something to take your mind off of that pain. Wait, 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 don't, don't. I come in peace. I think the word you're looking for is despair. Oh, hi there. I didn't see you there. I'm Ivana, Oracle of the Gods. Wait, did he rope you into one of his schemes? Never mind them. Ivana, I need you to locate something, and I request a reading as well. Why in the hell would I ever do that for you? 
You're the reason I'm stuck here in the first place. Please, I have to find my weapons. Someone stole them. I don't care. Get out of my face. <sighs> come on, mortal. Let's go. We'll come back another time. Hey, move your foot, kid. Trust me, you're better off just going back to where you came from. He's a monster who leaves nothing but pain and destruction in his wake. Oh, really? And pray tell, kid. Why should I let either of you in? I mean, you're cute and all, but not that cute. That power. Fine, kid. I'll give the Lord of Magic what he wants, but he has to do something for me in return. And what would that be? Release me from this cage, and then you've got yourself a deal. Wait, I can't just- Those are the terms. Take it or leave it. Fine. I accept. Thank you. Now, let's get this going. Mortal, I need a favor from you. Please, keep an open mind. I don't ever see Ivana unless I absolutely have to, and unless it's urgent. Her power can be... interesting, but also... All right, I'm gonna start now. Sit over there, please. Bound within a land of green, a god of light hides away, while four weapons ensure ruin is kept at bay. Stolen by balance and hidden away, someone who wishes for death to be brought this day. A savior must make a choice, give up their own life to save an innocent, or take a mantle of anguish for all eternity. The Lord of Magic must choose to be bound to an old flame or seek warmth anew. Ivana, where are my weapons? The amulet of Valdena rests with the Dragon Queen. The living sword is bound to despair. The cloak of the stars was gifted to ruin, by whom I cannot say. Finally, the wings of Aurora are still within their resting place. That's all I can see. Thank you, Ivana. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah. You better hold up your end of the agreement. Very well, Ivana. See you later. Yes. Yes, we did it. Good job, mortal. I didn't think you would call on your powers so early. What do you mean? Did you not notice? Whatever. For now, let us return to the hotel. Well, mortal, we need to go pay a visit to my daughter.